detailed analysis of the Anthony Joshua vs. Francis Ngannou fight, it was observed that Joshua dropped Ngannou twice before delivering the final knockout blow in the second round. You see that tonight? That was an absolute abomination. The analysis focused on the pathophysiology of concussions, emphasizing how Ngannou was already concussed after the initial knockdowns. Time was down because of already having a concussion from the previous hits, decreased reaction time, he's not able to react quick enough to get his gloves up to block this punch coming in from Joshua. The final punch, which led to Ngannou's defeat, exploited his decreased reaction time due to the concussion. The video further explained the impact of the punch on the vestibular control center behind the ear, potentially disrupting balance and coordination. The subsequent knockout displayed a sequence of responses, from initial muscle flaccidity to a posturing response typical in concussions. Overall, the analysis highlighted the physiological effects leading to Ngannou's defeat in the fight. The biggest shot I have seen live. That's what a right hand that was. Incredible. And you can see the leg completely. Hey, fight fans. Brace yourselves for our Titans Collide Boxing Analysis, breaking down the colossal clash between Anthony Joshua and Francis Ngannou. From thunderous knockdowns to the final decisive blow, we'll unravel the strategic brilliance and physiological intricacies that define this epic showdown. Before we dive in, hit like, subscribe, and ring the notification bell to stay updated on thrilling analyzes. Let the Titans Collide Analysis begin. And that is the biggest right hand I think I've ever seen live in a boxing ring. It is what it is. In a thorough examination of the Anthony Joshua versus Francis Ngannou showdown, it became evident that Joshua's strategy played a crucial role in securing Ngannou's defeat. Notably, Joshua scored two impactful knockdowns before delivering the decisive knockout in the second round. He knew he was throwing, he, the, the first step he took, he knew exactly what he was going to do, Anthony Joshua, there. he wasn't having a look, he knew what he was going to do, he just walked up and went crack. And that's... The analysis then delved into the science of concussions, emphasizing that Ngannou was already concussed following the initial knockdowns. The central focus was on the consequential decrease in Ngannou's reaction time, a critical factor that set the stage for the ultimate defeat. Further scrutiny was applied to the final punch that sealed Ngannou's fate. This punch strategically exploited Ngannou's compromised reaction time due to the earlier concussive blows. The explanation extended to the punch's impact on the vestibular control center situated behind the ear, potentially disrupting Ngannou's balance and coordination. As the analysis unfolded, attention was directed toward the subsequent knockout sequence, unveiling a series of physiological responses. The initial phase featured muscle flaccidity, a direct result of the significant depolarization in Ngannou's brain. This was succeeded by a posturing response, where an involuntary muscle rigidity occurred due to increased electrical activity in the brain. Summing up, the detailed analysis interconnected the sequential events of the fight with the underlying physiological effects of concussions. By unraveling the impact on reaction time, balance and coordination, the analysis provided a comprehensive understanding of the factors contributing to Ngannou's defeat at the hands of Anthony Joshua. Time, styles make fights and his style is made for me. When I've got through with a rabbit, then we go down for AJ. Thanks for joining us in this Titans Collide analysis of the Anthony Joshua versus Francis Ngannou fight. We hope you enjoyed the breakdown of the intense moments, strategic brilliance and physiological intricacies that shaped this epic showdown. If you found our analysis insightful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, subscribe to our channel for more thrilling content, and hit the notification bell to stay in the loop. Until next time, fight fans, keep your gloves up, and we'll catch you in the next round of analysis. Stay tuned for more action-packed insights.